Hey y'all, so, what's up, good morning, it's October 23rd, I think, it's like 5, we're out here in the garage, just sitting out here, so urinary tract infections with people in spinal cord injuries, that can be something that causes a lot of uh, problems, um, you know, when you have an indwelling catheter or something that's in your body, um, your body reacts to it, and you generally, you know, a lot of time you will get infections um, just because of the open. So this time I had one, and they gave me nitrofrotin, whatever you say it, and I finished it, and I was still having symptoms, and I called and called and called. Finally, they touched back and said, you know, it wasn't the right antibiotic, so instead of telling me two days in where I could have stopped and started taking the right one, I had to be on the phone and blowing them up all week to get the test results because I, I know what bugs I have and I just wanted to know the damn results. Finally, you know, sorry about it taking so long, but uh, that antibiotic isn't going to be effective. You know, here's some Levaquin. So five more days on the gut biome, you know, try to take probiotics in between doses. This is a once every 24 hour. So I take, uh, I'm going to take it in the morning and then at nighttime I'll take my probiotics to get my gut biome the night to, you know, reestablish some of them good bacteria until they're wiped out in the morning again. And then again, you know, probiotic. <clears throat> hopefully, hopefully this uh, antibiotic will hit my UTI and, you know, I can start getting to feeling some be feeling better. I've just been really drained. My energy's really down. Um, you know, I, I'm I just I'm not feeling well, man. But hopefully everything will be alright. We got a um, appointment down in St. Louis the twenty eighth for my GI, um, to discuss, you know, if colostomy is, is something that it needs to be considered right now or you know, what the out look and plan can be in that regards and at least they're sending me down to st louis um the slu uh, you know so at least down there in my area here we're in a real small area and i mean there are other spinal cord injuries obviously but you know i i feel that going down to a bigger city would give them doctors more um you know more experience with treating people with uh, limited mobility issues um, so we'll, we'll see how that one goes but you know that one could have some big implications ahead as well so just been really stressed out i love you all man uh, i hope everybody's doing great today uh, and i uh, hope we can do our best to put our game face on and uh get through to till tomorrow love y'all man peace